YouTube, it's the Brick Adjuster here with another monthly room tour for the month of December 2015. New this month, we have the LEGO Ideas Doctor Who set, we have the Avenged Jet from LEGO Marvel, and a few micro mocks. So here we go, enjoy! Here's the first new set and this is the LEGO Ideas Doctor Who. So it's up here with all my other LEGO Ideas sets. Wasn't sure if I was going to be able to fit it up here just because there's a lot. And also I'm not sure if we can put any future LEGO Ideas up here unless I somehow move those minifigure boxes out of the way over there. But these are the LEGO Ideas. Here's another new set and this is the Avenge Jet 2016. So I have it up here with all my other Avengers. So some new minifigures, Captain Marvel there. Hulk, I think Hulk is uh, is new for my room tour as well. And we got Quicksilver from another new set this month and also Ant-Man. But I already took those sets apart, parted them out. But we got the Stark Tower or Avengers Tower in the back over there. And then coming this way, we got the X-Men. We have the Guardians of the Galaxy with the modified Groot. And then over here we got Man of Steel. And coming along this way, this is new. Brick Box Lightning Lad, I got that for my Secret Santa. And just my Justice League minifigures behind there. And over here we got some Marvel minifigures. Then coming down we got the UCS Helicarrier, great looking set, and I stuck Captain America back there. Here we got the UCS Tumbler, which I heard is supposed to be retiring soon. These are great minifigures, Heath Ledger, Dark Knight. Here are all my Batman, and then we got Arkham Asylum, some Batman vehicles, mini Tumbler. And we got the Joker Funhouse Escape. Here is my Wizard of Oz mock that I'm going to bring to Philly Brickfest. I brought this to Brickfest Toronto. Here is my Cloud Cuckoo Land mock with Ducky Momo or the Cloud Cuckoo Duck with the Duck family. Here's another new mock that I made. It's my Micro Sea Cow, Metal Beard Sea Cow, right next to the UCS. Sika, which is enormous. Not really UCS, but it's a great looking set with my expanded double decker couch next to my micro double decker couch. In the back, we have other Lego Movie uh, vehicles. Keeping with the Lego Movie, we got Benny's spaceship over here, another great set. And we got the morphed bad cop. Here we have Emmett's Constructo Mech with my construction guy army in front. Here we got my micromanager army in the back chasing Wildstyle and Emmett. Here is my Unikitty army. All the Unikitties with the bad cops in Lord Business's Evil Lair. This here is from the Ant-Man set but I stuck it here because that is real size so you might as well make these real size here is my super secret police army and all just the cops that I have here's a mock that I just finished yesterday and this is supposed to be from Jurassic World it's one of the scenes where two main characters are looking through the I guess control panel area at the Indominus Rex and so the Indominus Rex is kind of hidden in there if you can see a red eye But this is eventually gonna go somewhere. I'm not sure where maybe in my Jurassic World area Here's my Jurassic World area. It's kind of small. So maybe I'll stick the mock in the back. I'm not sure yet Here's another new mock this month. This is the Justice League. This is supposed to be the Hall of Justice So we got all the characters in the front we got a pool of water with a kind of star and Batman and Superman. Here is Lego Ideas Big Bang Theory plus my mock just to modify it. And down here, Doctor Who. Not sure if this is new for the month, but it's somewhat new. This is Portal 2 and this is Ghostbusters. 
And then coming this way, I showed this last month. Scooby-Doo, Micro Scooby-Doo, Back to the Future, and The Simpsons. In the back, we got a dinosaur. We got a wedding of Queen Amidala and Darth Vader. Kind of see it there. Get some light. And over here, we got uh, Chewbacca. Whack the Chewbacca's. Here is another mock. This is supposed to be Ninjago, micro scale Ninjago, with the Temple of Air Jitsu. And here's the big Temple of Air Jitsu, which is a great looking set. Is this one new this month? It might. This one also might be new this month. I can't remember. I gotta look at last month's tour. And here are some more Ninjago sets, some mechs, and another temple here. Here's another new mock this month, and it is Lord of the Rings. So we got Frodo, Gandalf, Legolas, and Gimli with the Tower of Orthanc. Next to the big Tower of Orthanc, the real thing. And then we got Smaug the Dragon and the Lonely Mountain. We got the Black Gate with all the uruk -hais. So I'm still liking the Lord of the Rings. Oh, here's a new set. Big T just got this for Christmas, our first ever Technic set. And Big T, myself, and his Uncle Andrew, or the Brick Engineer, put this together on Christmas Day. Here is my Smalley World mock. So we got the uh, water rides with the rock climbing wall over here. We got some roller coasters. We got the kids area. And behind we got Smallville. So a lot of micro, a micro sick fig bridge over there. Skateboard park and zoo. And over here we just got some more micro, micro stadium. Interesting looking tower and just micro, micro, micro. Here are some more Hobbit Lord of the Rings sets. Goblin King with all my little goblins everywhere. Orc Forge behind. Here we got the Barrel Escape. The bunch of elves. Merc Merkwood elves over here. We got some wargs. We got Unexpected Gathering with the Hobbit house. Bilbo Baggins house. These are ants, so the ants are there, a lot of dust. And spiders, here is Goldagor, Dolgador, and the Fellowship of the Rings. So the seven, Heroic Seven. Weathertop, Attack on Weathertop. And over here we got Lake Town, Lake Town Escape. Oh, there's another set, here, let me show. Here's another Hobbit set that we put together, it's new. We haven't reviewed it yet, so it's just here. I usually put the sets that I have to review just in these boxes here. Eventually this will go in that Lord of the Ring Hobbit section. I just, maybe in Lake Town, I'm not sure. I have to figure out where to put it. Here's the infamous Sig Fig Bridge. A few new Sig Figs here this month. And over here we got a portrait from Dan Solo Gallery from last year. And a family portrait. And coming this way, just some other pictures from four of LEGO YouTubers from Dan Solo Galleries. And down here are our sick figs. And this is my tube luck sign and a couple awards I got for Mox. Here are the LEGO Simpsons. So we got the Quickie Mart with a bunch of Simpsons CMFs. And over here we got the Simpsons House. And again, some more CMFs just hanging out in the front. Here is Scooby-Doo. We got the Mystery Mansion over here. And I guess the Lighthouse. The Lighthouse might be new this month. Forgot about that. So the Lighthouse is there with the pumpkin guy that had this horseman. So these are not all the sets. The Mummy set isn't here, but a lot of the Scooby-Doo's finally got them. Okay, now for the modulars, we got the Grand Emporium, Expanded, we got the Town Hall, Expanded, I'm excited about the Brick Bank that's coming out January 1st, but I'm likely getting the, the Ghostbusters and 
see if I can fit it here. Not sure. I might have to move this set, the Imperial shuttle, out of the way. Maybe move it to the other side of the room. Here we got the expanded Parisian restaurant. Expanded sideways, so it's just doubled. And then we got the fire hall over here with my fire firefighter mech. And here we got the um, palace cinema. And it is no longer a corner, it is just a facing building, facing the side. Looks really cool. I like the indent still. And then we got the pet shop over here. And the detective's office with my barber quartet in the front. Here's the hot dog army. Those shark guys are coming soon in 2016 in the new CMFs. So I wonder how many shark guys I can get. Here is my house under renovation with all my renovating guys, hazmat suit. Shark guy will come here and join all these costume fellas. And over here we got the Joker or Jesters. Maybe I'll add that next one night, Jestro. That's a new kind of clown. Wonder if I'll get that on Bricklink or get the set. Hmm. Here is the Jock House. We got the cheerleaders on top with the zombie cheerleader. And down here are just all the exercisers, all the athletes just hanging out. And over here we got the cool kids house. We got the DJs and the pizza guys, the skateboarders, the band, and Paris and Brittany in the back with the disco dude and the disco dudette. Over here we got the surfers with the sharks. Ooh, the sharks are just coming along. And the lighthouse. That's not No More Bricks, someone else. It's just a regular sailor. And all the Christmas sets. We got the cottage over here, the winter cottage. This is the expanded train from one of those Christmas uh, exclusive sets, the giveaway sets. Here we got the market with the carousel. And coming this way are just some more winter village sets coming along. And then we got the expanded Santa's workshop with the expanded sleigh with all the reindeers. So that's nice with a bigger sled with more toys. And over there we got Chima, my last Chima set, still intact. Here is Hogwarts. So I'm wondering if we are going to get new Hogwarts or at least wizarding sets since there is going to be a new not a Harry Potter, but like a um, spin-off to Harry Potter movie coming out in 2016. So that's a mystery. We don't know yet. And here's another Harry Potter set with the Horizon Express in the back. Here is my Spaceman army, all my astronauts, my classic Spaceman in the front, a bunch of different space guys in the back, some astronauts and a Canadian flag. Here's Galaxy Squad. These are the vehicles I enjoyed in the Galaxy Squad theme. And over here are some aliens with a giant looking fly slash ant in the back. Here are all my architecture sets, which are a lot of them. And I'm looking forward to the new cityscapes that are coming out in 2016 and I have to figure out a place to put them all. So there's a bunch. Some of them are from JK Brickworks, from his design, but the others are actual sets. All right, Star Wars, my favorite Lego set with all these huge trees. A lot of trees here. Oh, this is new, the ATAP, I forgot about this. So I stuck the ATAP within my Ewok Village, even though it's supposed to be in Kashyyyk, but let's just put it here because the Wookiee gunship is supposed to be in Kashyyyk too. But just stuck it here anyways. But here are all the clone troopers in the front with a bunch of Wookiees. See, there's Wookiees in the Ewok Village. And a great looking set. And then we got the Sandcrawler, UCS Sandcrawler, 
with my Astro Mac Droids and some Jawas. We got a fifth Jawa there now from the Advent Calendar. And here is Mos Eisley's Cantina with the MTT in the back and a Land Speeder. Here is Jabba's Palace with the Rancor Pit underneath. Again, a very great looking set. And we got Jabba's Sail Barge. I was excited when that came out with all my bounty hunters, pirates, and the Sarlacc Pit with a Micro Sarlacc Pit and a Tuscan Raider. I think those were also from the Advent Calendar this year. Here are all my clone troopers. So a bunch of them with different colors. And then on this side we have Hoth, the Battle of Hoth going on. We have some ships down here. Might be parting this out soon. Not sure about the A-Wing. I might keep the A-Wing. Maybe part that out and keep the Y-Wing. We'll see when the new sets start coming out and I need more space. Here's the Death Star and they say a new Death Star is coming out in 2016. And it might look a bit different because I watched the movie and the movie's Death Star, the new movie looks different from the old Death Star. Here we got another advanced prototype, TIE advanced prototype with a micro version over there. And let's look at some more Star Wars ships. I like those big Star Wars ships. There's a couple that are out right now and I still haven't picked them up. But maybe when they go on clearance I might eventually get those big Star Wars ships. I can't remember the names now though. But here are some more bigger Star Wars ships. The old Millennium Falcon. I'm not sure if I'm getting the new one or not. And some more vehicles. I might finally disassemble that um, Mandalorian ship as well. Pres I think it's called Pres Vissala. Here is my Sith army minus Kylo Ren. Still gotta get Kylo Ren. I like that character from the movie. And up here we got my Jedi's. All the Jedi's that I have. And then up here we got the UCS B Wing with some more Star Wars, a headless Darth Vader. And we got Brick Set, Brick Fat Toronto, Marty Swag, Marty Gras Swag, and some keychain. Here is the UCS RTD2 and an ATAT. And down here we got the new C3PO Santa with Darth Vader Santa, Darth Maul Santa, Django Santa, or is that Baba Santa? Can't remember now. And Yoda Santa behind. We got the Celebration Star Wars characters with their medals. And just some more Star Wars characters there. And up here we have the Super Star Destroyer. Another great looking big gray set. And the last Star Wars set would be the Slave One. And maybe I'll be putting the Imperial Shuttle beside this when I get the Fire Hall. Here is my Western scene with all my Lone Rangers and Lego Movie Western characters. And next door we got Monster Fighters, so the Haunted Mansion, and a bunch of different monsters just all set up here. They're all crooked now, I gotta line those up better. And we got the Vampire Castle. Over here we got Pharaoh's Quest, the Pyramid, and the Sphinx. Oh, the Sphinx is over here, and the Sphinx, and the Cobra, with some, um, what are these guys called again? Prince of Persia. Prince of Persia over here, and Indiana Jones, with Johnny Thunder. Not Johnny Quest. And we got Pirates of the Caribbean. So these are all my Pirates of the Caribbean sets over here. Oh, someone's knocked over. Gotta pick them up. And here are some outdoor sets. We got the mountain hut and the log cabin. Here is our pirate set, which Big T likes playing. And over here we got the Ferrari and just a sports car. This is Minecraft, the micro Minecraft with some other Minecraft figures, some uh, monthly mini builds, 
We got some more minifigures up here. And some DC villains over here. And then behind are some more minifigures. These are from the new 2016 set, which are cool. Don't have another box behind that one though. Here are my Ninja Turtle minifigures. Just the minifigures, not the sets. And just like Ninja Turtles, just the minifigures, not the sets of Spongebob. Some more Spongebob minifigures over here with Simpsons behind. And then we got Toy Story. The Toy Soldiers. And some more Toy Story. Then we got some Ninjago minifigures. These ones up front are from the Temple of Air Jitsu, so they're kind of new. And some more back there. And some more Ninjago minifigures here. Oh, Zane has no mask. I borrowed his mask from one of my mocks. And over here. Alright, last but not least, we got Chima. Can't forget the Chima. Here are all my Chima minifigures, my army of Chima. A lot of chi here. Here's Big T's base. And it's kind of cleaned up a little bit. So I decided to show it. We haven't done a base update in a while. That's not Lego, it's just a horse. And some big figs. And down here are his guys. He tried to line them up nicely. But a bunch of these will be going to Philly Brickfest. This is somewhat new. Daredevil. Hmm. He had Punisher here somewhere. Where's Punisher? I can't find it. Oh, here's Punisher. So this is his Punisher. He needs a skull though. Still working on him. So this concludes this LEGO Room Tour for the month of December 2015. This is the Brick Adjuster signing off. Thanks for watching and we will see you guys in another video. Bye!